Hello, today I would like to show you something interesting that I recently purchased from China. From some time I was looking for an infrared illuminator for my night vision and I, I'm not planning to have this device hook up on my night vision goggles because infrared is going to be visible by anyone who's also using the night vision set. But this is very cheap and you can put it in a strategic location and it can give you a advantage that you're going to see what's going on and if it's going to be detected you can leave it as is. So you can put it far away and you can illuminate a road or a passage and if it die, if it's going to be taken away then absolutely no problem and that was the reason why I purchased it. This is a 850 nanometers. As you can see it's looking exactly like a regular cheap Chinese flashlight with ability to adjust the zoom so you can have a wide sp spread light float or a very directional that is going into a square as a diode because inside let's take it apart inside we've got this terrible small looking diode so it is absolutely nothing fancy but for the price it was cost like a five US dollars I believe that was a good buy and it's power from a 1.5 volt battery but I also expect it's going to be working on a 3 volt recharge able batteries I believe it was stated in the manual and let's power it on and we can assume that it is broken because you cannot see anything or maybe you can barely see yes you can see that it is working it has a very very small faint red red square inside but you cannot see it without a night vision goggles so very good option and now question is how we can test it and I was thinking because recording of a night vision was a bad idea here I've got a vintage video camera that have a night shot mode which basically give us a pretty basic night vision so let's try to power it on and I will record some footage for you so you will be able to see we go into the camera mode yes that's Correct, we go to the night shot. As you can see, we've got a greenish look like it should be. And let's see. As you can see, it gives you a very bright light. So it is definitely working. You can see a spotlight moving. Take a look through the through the LCD. And you can see it. So now I'm going to try record something with this camera and we are going to compare it across the built-in LED illuminator. There is a very small diode that is built in. Okay, so the camera is rolling, the night shot mode is off and as you can see we cannot see anything I'm going to enable night shot and as you can see we can see something at the end of my room those are the built-in diodes I'm going to put a flashlight in front of the camera as you can see everything is working but at the distance now I'm going to enable our light and we are going to be able to see the difference. 
So this is how it looks like with the infrared illuminator. I'm going to cover it without, with, without, and with. And we can focus to get a more spotlight. So I'm looking right now through window and I am zoom in and as you can see the built-in illuminator does absolutely nothing and I'm going to use our illuminator let me get a spot and that's the difference without with and we can make it wider just like that with the illuminator without and with so as you can see we've got a pretty pretty big difference so thank you very much for watching i hope you find that interesting see you next time and bye bye